really aim at the academy to make sure that every young person in our care leaves the academy having got the correct qualifications and the right experience to become fulfilled citizens in their community and also able to do the job that they want to do for the future. We believe in the academy that um, if youngsters are ready to either take a test, um, sit an exam or submit a portfolio of work, that um, they do that when they're ready, it doesn't matter what age they are. We use a variety of different tools to ensure that our learning is uh, dynamic and lively in the classroom. And one of the things that we use is time. A learning episode does not have to be an hour long. Um, I don't know why lessons are an hour long when you think about it, why is that? In reality, learning can be anything from five minutes to six hours, and the academy day is long, and within our school, some learning episodes will last the full six hours, but within that, there will be different episodes, and it might be different places for learning within that. The pace of learning is very important too. It's a key feature of a well-disciplined environment that uh, the pace is lively, and we try very hard to ensure that we listen to young people. Student voice is really important to us, and we listen to them about when we need to have breaks and when we need to change the uh, structure of the learning so that they remain engaged. We believe flexibility is very important, mainly for two reasons. Um, in the first place, we believe that young people learn at different rates and in different ways, um, so flexibility in terms of curriculum is, is, is important. Flexibility is also important because we consider relationships to be very important and integral to, to how we work and what we do. Um, relationships both with the young people as well as with their parents and the families from where they are reaching. Our terms are focused um, on aspects of learning uh, quite singularly in the sense that in term one and term two we're very much looking at the personal and team building skills that young people need to move forward in life, not just at school but for all of life. So in term one we look very much at what we need in our own personal skills and we would theme this with the idea that we work hard, we get rewarded, we enjoy life. So as much as we're about working hard, we're also about getting rewards for that hard work. The philosophy we have about you work hard, you get the rewards is very much fun time Friday. The idea is that during the week, uh, in every lesson, pupils that are working hard will get a simple raffle ticket, which goes into a draw that all pupils witness on a Friday afternoon just after lunch. 15 very lucky pupils will get a ticket that wins and they will go into our reward room and get to use all the games consoles and the other leisure activities in the reward room for the remainder of the afternoon on the school day. We're quite unique in, in the academy in that we have our own um, student support team. They're a group of professionals who are non-teachers and 100% of their time is spent actually looking after the young people's needs so that there is no inhibition to their learning. So that's led by a student support manager and they look after things like attendance, behaviour, inclusion issues. There's a dedicated anti-bullying coordinator so if a child feels that they're being bullied in school they have somebody they can go directly to. Overall that core team forms uh, if you like, a team around the young person. So um, you'll have people that are bringing in the academic information, the pastoral care information, the data, the performance, the literacy, everything, so that we have a very coherent picture of that young person and their, their performance, if you like, within the school and within the academy. I'd like to thank you for taking the time to watch this DVD and finding out a little bit about the academy and how we work. Please, please take the opportunity to come and see for yourself. Don't believe what others say, come and find out. After you've been and seen, if you decide that St Oldham's Academy isn't the right place for your young person, may I wish you all the best in the future. But at least you've come and seen for yourself.